Welcome back to the Eternal Sith Network, where today we're going to be talking about a character that we could be seeing in the Ahsoka series that has a Legends and Canon story. But before we do get into that, remember, hit that subscribe button because I know you love coming back to the Eternal Sith Network. And if you're new here, welcome to the channel. We're almost at 3,000, so make sure you go subscribe. Also, go hit that like button so that way we get this video trending. And also, go hit that notification bell so you're always in the know on everything that's going on in the Star Wars universe. And also go check out my last video and give it a thumbs up as soon as you're done watching this one. Let's start the show. So today we're gonna to be talking about this character who drastically is different in the Legends continuity, matching that of Anakin Skywalker's age and remaining true to the Jedi ways throughout the war. Now, the character that we're going to be talking about today is Barris Offee, who had became a Jedi Knight and actually took a Padawan under her wing by the time she actually died on Felucia. Now, the Legends era Offee has a particular talent using the Force to heal others, using her abilities to aid wounded clone troopers, making her Order 66 death all the more tragic. Offee's growth from Padawan to Jedi healer is shown throughout Legends era comics like the Clone Wars Adventures and the webcomic Reversal of Fortune, as well as the MedStar novels. Now, Offie's different depictions in the Legends material and canon Star Wars The Clone Wars animated series are among many examples of why the newer Clone Wars series was never meant to fit into the Star Wars Legends continuity despite premiering before 2014. The Clone Wars era by Dave Filoni's admission initially told its own version of the war making it only fit to the current canon where Offie's story can be finished in future projects or the Ahsoka series such as. So in the Star Wars Legends Barriss Offie is a completely different character whose essential death was cut short when Order 66 was activated. So if they use the Ahsoka series which they have announced that there's going to be a Jedi that we might see in this series that we don't know of yet that hasn't been confirmed, but they have said that that's confirmed, we just don't know which character is confirmed other than Ezra, that we will see a character that Ahsoka has once known. So I'm thinking that it's going to be this character because again, her character was not confirmed of death in the Clone Wars. And again, the Clone Wars is Dave Filoni's baby and it was told to us that recently and I talked about this in another video that he was glossy eyed watching one of the episodes. Now it could have been that it was watching possibly Anakin or something but I'm thinking that Barriss Offee makes her debut again in live action which we've seen her in the prequels in live action in the movies but why not make her come back in the Ahsoka series so that's how I believe we will see her character come back to live action but anyway guys had to give this news out to you guys comment down comment down below do you want to see barris offy in live action come in the ahsoka series does it make sense to you comment why or why not and let's get the comment section rolling out but anyway guys thank you so much for tuning in today hit the subscribe button as we are almost at 3000 if you're new to the channel welcome and hit that subscribe button hit that like button so we get this video going also hit that notification bell so you're always in the know Thank you so much for tuning in today, guys. Stay tuned as I have another video out tomorrow. Later, guys.